Oh, I just took the most glorious piss. What's up, guys? BTBS here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. I am being a busy little beaver here. I've been digging away at uh, my third hole. Um, it gives me something to do to fill the time, and it's also a great way of getting cobble and other resources. Let's just. Uh, it's Gakwi mode. So look, because if you turn on uh, creative, you it gets rid of void fog, which is uh, really nice actually. We said add a potion to the game that would get rid of void fog. So as you can see, I have two fully completed holes, all the exact same dimensions, and this one here, which is taking shape. So I've gone uh, down here and did a lot. It's taking a lot longer than I thought because th this area here is all one layer thick, right? I didn't punch a torch out, did I? No, good. But, um, as you can see, there's a little bit of uh, obsidian right there. And I've pulled 12 stacks of obsidian out of this area, so basically, like, most of this floor up to about the ceiling height, where uh, when I was building the this one here, I literally just poured water over it and then put some stone down because I didn't think I was going to be building below it but uh, yeah I've been building below it so I've had to pull out around 12 stacks of obsidian just for uh, that little bit there and I then came over here right down the end of Mia and where that cobble is oh I hear a slime right where that cobble is there there is I believe yeah, lava behind it, which is not the most fantastic thing. God, I can't spell and talk at the same time. Game mode S, there we go. Yay, jumpy jumpy. Yeah, it's not the most fantastic thing, but I suppose it's another way for me to get a bunch of... Uh... Come on, where's the other lot? You never find lapis in single blocks of sex, do you? Maybe you do, huh? Uh, it's not the most fantastic thing, but it does mean I can get some more, uh, the hell was that? Oh. Um, right, let me, let me try and finish this sentence. It's not the most fantastic thing, but it does mean I can get more obsidian. So where are these slimes? Yeah, right above me. I love how you can see their fappings coming through the floor. So uh, I've actually been hunting down these slimes with extreme prejudice. With uh, looting three swords. I wasn't expecting to find any slimes this time, so I only have a looting three. Usually I'll carry another sword as well, just so that I don't have to use my looting three to kill them. But yeah, I've been getting a decent amount of slime balls. I've done uh, a lot of work on the old Ender Ender. And I shall go and show you this. How pro am I with Ender Pearls? Oh, I'm getting better. Where's my hole? There it is. Yeah, right down there. Down in one. So we just navigate this impossible series of things. And, uh, oh god, I hope that ghast is gone. On the way over here, I got attacked. Oh no, I think he's still here. I got attacked by a ghastly pops, and the bastard almost knocked me off the platform. It was if I had it hadn't had my ender pearls with me. I think I used a few already. Um, I was basically I was jump I was jumping like sprint jumping to get maximum speed, and this fucking ghast shot me like right under my feet and grenade jumped me, and I was like bang oh shit there it is. Hey, there's a huge magma cube there. That thing must die. Oh, I think it just killed itself. Brilliant. I think it's interesting, uh, if you kill a ghast, its fireballs, oh you fucker, disappear. Don't hit the pigman, don't hit the pigman. Right, kill these. I've been actually meaning to collect some uh, fire slime things. What are they called? Come on, help me out, guys. Magma creams. Thank you. 
Yes, I like you. You're always a good sub. Oh uh, yeah, I was, <laughs> I, I was jumping and it shot underneath me and I grenade jumped basically. And I was going over the edge just down here. See, that's where this fire came from. And I was about, you know, like five blocks out here and I chucked an ender pearl. Just because it's just become reflexive now. I just switched to my ender pearls. I was like, fuck! From through the ender pearl. And I fell about halfway down and I thought, I'm going to die, I'm going to lose my picks. And my ender pearl landed and I was just like, fucking yes. I felt so pro. Oh, shame no one saw it, really. Why did I come back here? Um, oh yeah, this is pretty much everything, all the uh, in interesting stuff that I've dug out. Duggan? Diggin? Dug? Dug. That I've dug out from uh, digging my holes. A lot of it has already been taken, like I took, at one point I took all of my diamonds and I fortune threed them just to get more diamonds. Because I've been doing a lot more enchanting because my ender ender, uh, it's not finished. But it is actually running. Yeah, basically in China, a whole bunch of shit swords. When I, when I get the uh, anvils, I might just like try and enchant them all together and see what I can get. Oh. But I'm running out of iron very desperately, so I need to cook some up. And I'm actually starting to run out of food as well. Uh, that one. So I went over uh, to my original my uh, house, my town, the magic. And I cooked some food up. I not cooked some food up. I killed some food up. And yeah, because I've been. Uh, I can't resist when I'm at the ender ender. If I see an enderman down the bottom and I'm down there, I have to punch it. And then more more of them come along, and I have to punch them as well. And it's like it's like a vicious vicious circle because I can't stop punching endermen. And also, all the times I keep falling off of the ender ender don't help my food supplies either. Because I generally carry at least a quarter up to a stack of food with me at any one time. So, uh, I generally, if I die, I lose a lot of food. And it adds up. I mean, I may have had like 30 stacks of food, and I think I said something like I wouldn't have to harvest more cows until like episode 100 or something. But we have to be realistic sometimes. Oh, don't give me that look. I don't like being realistic either. You know, it's um, it's very strange. This thing about doing commentaries for Minecraft is that sometimes when I'm doing them, it feels sort of like I've got an imaginary friend that I'm talking to. So some of the things I say might sound a little out of place. But they sound right in my head, and they just sort of... It, to me, it just seems like I'm talking to an imaginary friend, because... You know, I'm the only person who really knows that you guys are there. You know, I, I know you're there, because you comment on my videos, you give me ideas, you give me support, and I love you guys. But for anyone else, I could be making all that up, and they could just be like... Yeah, well, he's fucking insane. I've never seen any of these people. Where are we going? Um, are we going to the endy under? Endy, 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 endy. So I better grab me a pumper can. And I, um, I decided the best thing to do was not get killed by um, Enderman by pumpkins. So, oh, what's that? You notice? No pumpkin hard. Yeah, I got, um, basically I can't work with the pumpkin hard on, it's horrible and disgusting and distracts me. Actually no, I need more materials. But it's impossible to build an ender ender, unless you've got more than one person. And, you know, it's impossible to build one without just getting constantly like molested by endermen. And I don't know about you, but that does not generally fit into my like daily schedule. Uh, they wish it did, I tell you that. They have been all over me. They've been over me like ants over sugar. Or something funny and sexual and innuendo sounding. Just take a drink here, try and wake myself up a bit. Ah, that's better. Yeah, it's been.
been a long... Which way am I going? I'm going to the end. I need to go down. It's been a long old day for me today. Whew. So... Uh, for those of you who watch my FTL Let's Play, you may have noticed that it is now, as all my videos should be, uh, 720p HD. And uh, it may cause a couple of problems. I'm um, still playing around with it. I'm having a few problems with different file types, trying to get the audio to actually like sync up with the video and stuff like that, and trying to not lose my frames. Because... Um, since I started recording Minecraft, since I very since I first started, I've been recording in uh, like 70 frames a second or something like that. Let's have a look. Uh, 60 frames a second, and it hasn't been coming out in my videos like that. And that is because I use a extremely cheap, so cheap that it's free, uh, video editing and rendering software called FreeMake. It does absolutely everything I want it to do. It's fantastic. But it does have a couple of problems. And one of them is it doesn't tell you that it's actually reducing your frame quality down to 27 or so. So I'm actually losing pretty much everything I'm recording in. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, I've uh, been building a little bit on here. I've still got a few problems with the old uh, Enderman here just walking out of the thing. You know, I should probably turn my sound down a bit if I'm going to be here. And turn my par titles off. So yeah, I went with um, these strong stone columns. And then alternated... Move. One hit kill. Absolutely love it. Uh, alternated having the half slabs on the top half of the block and in the bottom half. And I found a fantastically enjoyable bug. And I didn't realise how much work it was going to be to get all the half slabs in. I've done three so far. And every single one of these needs to be pretty much full with no three block gaps. Otherwise the endermen end up doing that. They, 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 come up, they land up here. Like they land here usually because they can swing over to the edge. And if you notice, they're not on one hit. They're actually on three which is a problem and as uh, until I get the water up here these ones from down here can actually teleport up here at any point so you know I've got a lot of work to do on the ender ender but it is functional as you can tell and the other day I did have 70 levels because I was building it every time I came down here I was just killing them off to get rid of some entities and uh, I just sort of forgot that my levels were building up. I'm not as stingy about my levels as I used to be. Like, I used to work out the exact amount of spiders I needed for the right level, that sort of thing. But now I just need to spend like a minute here punching some enders, and I've got X amount of levels. It's fantastic. I can see why all the um, big servers use ender enders. And they're so simple to build as well. Like, I built this one entirely on my own, and I had absolutely no problem doing it, apart from all the dying, which we won't talk about. Yes, good, thank you. Oh, I know you guys enjoy my dying. I've been told by some of my very close friends who watch my videos that, oh, you're dying, your, uh, your death gurgles at the end. They've really made the video fantastic. I was like... Because you know it means I'm going to have to try and kill myself more often if you guys are enjoying it. Which isn't, you know, it's not to say that I won't do it. It's to say I'd rather not have to do it. Because when I die, it's a big, big inconvenience for me. I mean, yeah, it may be absolutely hilarious as balls to everybody else, but not for me. <sighs> but, you know, I'm sure I'm going to die more. It's just kind of what I do. And I must say, I was actually talking to some of my um, my college mates about this. When I first got fucked over by the Enderman and I fell down and I used that trick with the bucket of water, I happened to think that was absolutely genius. And that was the reason I kept the water on my bar, but I didn't realise... What was that? I didn't realise uh, my reactions were gonna, going to allow me to actually do it at that point. 
So yes, I'm kind of proud of my own reactions for that. Hey guys. Oh yeah, there's no glass on this level yet. Shit. Ah, that could be why there's the... It's not working at full capacity. There ain't even glass on this bloody level. That's annoying. There's a lot of these fuckers up here as well. Hey, 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 down you go. Oh, you mad, son. I just remember they can teleport. <laughs> I think uh, Ender Enders are going to be a lot more terrifying in, after the new update when Endermen have their new sounds. You know, those sounds? Kind of awesome. Kind of terrifying and creepy. Either way, I kind of fucking love them. Oh, So yes, um, I am going to be uploading all my videos, uh, rendering all my videos in at least 720p for now. I'm going to try and get out as many videos as I can, but with uh, the amount of time it now takes to render my episodes, uh, my episodes now take around four to five hours to render and an additional what is it, six just to upload for like a 30 minute episode. So there may be a little bit of, um, you know, it may be that an episode comes out late once in a while. I'm going to try and pre-record some so that I have a backup and I never have to worry about uh, not having an episode to put out because I hate not having an episode out even for one day like I did the other day. Yeah, you're fucking falling now, ain't ya? You scumbags. And uh, I know someone mentioned in the comments that I could actually cut out uh, another layer of torches on this by doing... Uh, oh, we yeah, are moving the pistons down. But I'm... Like I said in the comment, I just... I uh, came up with this uh, precise design for an ender render on my own just uh, derping around in my creative world and I happen to be very proud of it and I've never seen this configuration used before I'm sure someone has, probably like Etho that fucker beats me to everything or JL, who steals my ideas uh, I'm not jealous, I'm not paranoid either but uh, yeah, I like this I like this design I don't really need to worry about budgeting my redstone, I've got plenty and I don't want to half arse it when it comes to my grinder especially seeing as uh, in the new snapshot this is going to be the uh, new snapshot, the new update. This is going to be my number one grinder because they're going to be nerfing natural spawn, uh, not natural mob spawned grinders, aren't they? The spawn grinders. They're going to be El Nerfa Runeed, which I don't, in which I'm not going to enjoy. Because you know, why put something like a spawner into the game if you're just going to fuck it up? I mean, I haven't been keeping up with the snapshots uh, a lot lately because I haven't had time, but from what I've seen of uh, Bitha, from Biffa on his Redux world and the Mindcrack and Hermitcraft guys on the servers there's a lot a lot of really interesting stuff that I can't wait to get into especially renaming and item frames and the Wither and beacons I've had a few really good idea for, ideas for beacons that are more suited to like map making but, uh, oh shit, I, I, ah, bollocks. Yeah, more suited to map making, but I think could be done quite well in a single player world. So I'm going to be uh, exploring a little bit with that. So what are we doing here? This goes here, yes. It's so much easier to build with a pumpkin on. Yeah, I don't like having the full blocks. Not half blocks, half blocks for a reason. Got something stuck in my gum. Ugh. Some of you guys, you guys must know. Like, say when you eat like popcorn or something, you get a little bit of uh, the kernel or the shell like stuck at the back of your mouth, and it just irritates you. Well, mine sort of gets wedged in my dodgy wisdom teeth, and just kind of aggravates me. And I think it's been there for a couple of days. And I know what you're gonna say. Oh, brush your teeth, all that shit. Doesn't work. Never works. I just have to kind of wait. I will find out what it is though. I will find the culprit. Ah, 
Oh, I have no more half slabs left then. Yeah, let's just build this bit on. I keep walking off the back of this, like, I idiotically. I'm ju I'll just be running backwards, placing those, and I'll just run straight off the edge. Luckily, I haven't done it on camera, so, you know, you guys can't mock me over it. Nah, you guys don't mock me, you love me. And yeah, you love the old skelly bobs. Ah, skelly bob. Oh. Right, we want this to come out to here. See, I don't know if you guys are enjoying watching me build or whatever, but apparently you want to see it, so... I'm going to do my best to put out as many videos as I can, remembering, trying to f uh, focus on what you guys actually want to see, so like building and uh, testing of stuff. And I would have showed my building of like the uh, the double cobblestone farm, or the the other thing that I built, the, the thing, oh shit, I have no pressure plates. The th you know, the thing that I built. Um, we're going to have to ask for help here again, guys. Yep, the potion lab. That's the one. I don't know how my brain works, but apparently I'm hearing you. Yeah, you. The one who just said, who, me? Yeah, you. I'm hearing you. I seriously tell. Oh, anybody said that, but if they did, it's going to absolutely fuck with their head. Would you mind? I'm trying to build here. And repeat it there. Ooh. It's so sketchy building on here. Like if I fall, I have to either grab an ender pearl and like spin around and throw it at one of these, or I have to try and remember to just hold shift so that as I go through the vines I can grab onto them. And I don't think I've ever remembered to hold shift and grab the vines. Like I said, my brain don't work like a normal brain. This thing is definitely special. Right, so we get some stone bricks here. Oh, yeah, I usually place them on the redstone. Shit. Right, on there. Aha, uh -huh, you fell. Your shit. So let's just get some more stone brick. I do love stone brick as a building material. I'm quite excited about uh, cobble fence. Yeah, I know. I'm coming close to the edge. I'm not going to let you guys see me die today, at least not intentionally. I'm going to try my best not to die. It's one of the reasons it's taken me so long to build this ender ender. Is that um, I keep getting killed and losing everything. Like every time I die I lose like a couple of stacks of sticky pistons or a few stacks of stone blocks and some re and the stack, couple of stacks of repeaters and redstone and levers, not levers, pressure plates. And it may not seem like a lot one at a time, which it's not, but when you consider how many times I've died just building this, it fucking adds up. It ends up being a little bit ridiculous, I must say. I mean, even I'm kind of disappointed how often I die on this. But it'll all be worth it once I have all these uh, enchants coming through. Let's just make sure there's one on every single one. Oh, God, it's so, like... What's the word? Um... No, that's not the right word. Uh, I'm not going to ask for help on this one, so I, I've got to get one of these for myself. I want to say, like, vertigo inducing. It's not too bad here, but then I can't see down. Like, just looking down from there. <laughs> oh, Minecraft, why are you so broken? Oh, shit. Um, can't do that. You motherfucker! Move! Move! Oh. Henderman, why you tro troll me so? Haha, uh -huh, you fell. Right, we can jump onto here, push you off, and then we can do this. Yeah! I fucking love ender pearls! They are fantastic! So, did I finish this one? Yeah, looking down from looking down like this, especially when you're hanging over the edge of the block to place on the side of it, it's. It makes me like feel vertigo, like fear of heights shit, even though I don't suffer from that and I actually quite enjoy heights. But you know, that could just be a trolling thing. So yeah, we've got a couple more torches and then we need some more stone brick. And I'm gonna move. God, 
I'm so worried about one of them fuckers coming back for me afterwards. Just like an Enderman just like bobs up to me with a knife, just like, hey, the fuck you think you're doing? We didn't half slab this. You were supposed to remind me! Urgh. Yeah, I have to half slab the uh, bit behind the pistons just so that there's only two and a half blocks because Endermen are like 2.8 blocks high so they can fit in a three block gap as everybody knows but they can't fit in a two and a half so it's all good I just have to get out of there Creature of the Night, I banish thee! Hey, it worked Hmm, if I end a pearl there, he's going to attack me because <laughs> I'm going to aggro the fucker, ain't I? Let's uh, try this. Nope. Oh yeah, of course, they're half slabs. Fantastic. Can I throw one over? It's a bit of a risky shot. Oh god, I think I aggroed one of them. No, did I, did I not? Did, are you gonna, is the game going to be nice? Am I going to not get an aggro there? What the? Dude is going mental. Excuse me. Hey. Hey. Enderman. Oh. Bye. Do you want to say hello? So we're just going to drop down here and get these ones as well. And we're going to go for another chum 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 pro ender pearl shot there. Here. Oh god, if he ambushes me on here, I'm fucked. Oh, I don't want to die anymore. I don't want to die anymore. No more dying. No mass. You mean no likey dying. Thank you. That's why I'm just trying to use my body as much as possible. Just just press it up to the endermen until they run away scared. No. I'm, I'm just trying to push them off the edge so I don't have to deal with them. Trying to be as safe as possible. Because sometimes safety does matter. When you've died as many times as me. Oh god, I need something to talk about. I'm just going back. No, stop moving, you fucker! Alright, fuck. Oh! No. Almost. You're not getting it just yet, you fuckers. You have to earn it. <laughs> Ooh, that was so close. Right, can I do a shot like this? Nope. What about this? What about if I jump? Can I go like that? Yes. Lovely, that one worked. Oh, why is there half slab? Mm, oh, I was bricking this, but I didn't finish half slabbing it. Wait, wait, wait. Half slab first. Brick later on. I always end up bricking it later on. Just where I'm on this fucking thing. Right, off you go, off you go. Right. Make sure I'm sneaking. Right, let's just knock this out. And then knock that out. Yeah, off you go, you vibrating bastard. They do, they vibrate. And I find that very creepy. I mean, how many things do you know that are long, black, and vibrate? Yeah, they're usually called. I'm not gonna say that actually. <laughs> No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna avoid. I'm gonna let you uh, leave it to your imaginations. You know exactly what you're thinking. Yeah, neck massages. Move, move. I'm getting a bit cocky here. This is this is the part where I usually die. Getting cocky, you know, just punching the bastards around. No! 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 Switch to your sword! Switch to your sword! God, I had to use the hotkeys then. I never use the hotkeys because I'm like relatively new to PC gaming and stuff and I'm not used. I'm not used to like hotkeys and home keys and stuff. I usually just like scroll through my bar but if I had, if I stopped to scroll I'd have to take my uh, finger off and away and stop attacking. Off you go. Oi! Off you fuck! Wait, there was no torch there. Oh, because that block's not supposed to be there. Lovely. 
Right, so I've built about half of the uh, newest level of the Ender Ender. I think I'm going to leave it there for now because we're approaching about half an hour already, which is uh, absolutely ridiculous. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I don't know, there's no specific comment, uh, no specific topic, but if you've got anything to say, leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you guys. I always get back to as many as I can. Uh, peace out. Don't worry, I know that I've had over 30 levels for this entire episode, so I decided I was going to finish off the episode with a nice little enchant, just just so that you guys that were getting driven absolutely insane by it, you know, if you watch to the end, here's your prize. So I'm just going to randomly click a few times, just say stop, and there we go. Uh,